In an examination, the maximum marks for each of the four papers, P, Q, R and S are 100. So there are four papers, P, Q, R and S. And each paper, the maximum mark is 100. So the total mark will be 400. Marks scored by the students are in integers. A student can score 99 percentage in n different ways. So 99 percentage means 99 percentage of total mark that is 400. So you will get 99 by 100 into 400. So you will get 99 into 4 which is equal to 396. So a student's student scored 396 mark. Okay, a student scored 396 mark. So we need to see how many ways the student student can score 396 mark. Right. So here try different possibilities let's say this is p in p he scored 100 in q also he scored 100 and r also he scored 100 and in s he scored 96 so 100 100 100 96 is a possibility so s can be 96 either r can be 96 or q can be 96 and p can be 96 so there will be total four possibilities in this combination 100 100 100 96 there are four combinations because here S is 96, similarly R could, could be 96 and all other can be 100, uh, Q could be 96, all other can be 100, P could be 96 and all other can be 100. So there are total four possibilities. Now let's take the next combination possible. So let's say in two papers he got 100 and in the next paper he got 99 and in the other paper he got 97. So this is a possibility. If you add all these things, you will get 396. So I will tell you an easier way in which you can take the uh, possibilities. How much, how, in how many ways we can arrange 100, 100, 99 and 97 among four papers. So you know that here that if these are different, if the marks are different, then there will be total four factorial possibilities. Right. But here two papers are getting same mark. So you need to do 2, 4 factorial by 2 factorial. So if you do 4 factorial by 2 factorial, you will get 12. So there are 12 possibilities, 12 ways in which the group 100, 100, 99, 97 can be arranged among 4 papers P, Q, R and S. Similarly, just try the next possibility. Okay. So 100, 100, 98, 98 is a possibility. So here actually 100 is coming 2 times. And 98 is also coming two times. So how many possibilities will be there? 4 factorial divided by 2 factorial into 2 factorial. So if you do this, you will get 6. So total 6 possibilities are there in this arrangement. Similarly, there is another possibility 100, 99, 99, 98. So this is also possible. So if you do similarly, it will come also 12 because 99 is coming two times. Similarly, there is another possibility 99, 99, 99, 99. This is also a different possibility. So this is only one will come because all are 99. So if you add all this thing, 4 plus 12 is 16, 16 uh, plus 6 is 22, 22 plus 12 is uh, uh, 34, 34 plus 1 is 35. So total 35 possibilities are there. So option D is the right answer.